Hey guys, Rory from ANS Gear. We've got a tool from Ninja on the table today. This is the uh, Ninja Regulator Assembly Tool. So this will help you both take a regulator off of your Ninja bottle and put a regulator onto your Ninja bottle. There are two different versions of this tool though. We've got this one over here. This is the Pro V2 and Standard Tool. So this is gonna work for your Pro V2 regs, like this one right here. We've got a Pro V2 reg on here. We've got a Pro V2 reg up on that other one. So Pro V2 and standard and ultralight. So it'll work for all of these setups. Now it doesn't matter whether it's a 3K or a 4500, but it will work for all of them. And this just drops down inside and it's gonna hold your regulator in there. And then you would use a strap wrench on the bottle. Let's take this one. Like this. And then take it off. Now these are solid aluminum. They are not light, they are heavy. And um, get in there bottle. They're meant to be mounted in two ways. So you can put this in a vise so you could clamp it from both sides in a vise and hold onto it that way. Or it does have two holes. These are 5 16 18 UNC thread on there. Tells you on it. So you can mount it to the side of a table, you know, on the side like that. So it will be mounted with two screws coming in this way. And then you could use it that way. I use it downstairs on the vise. We mount it inside the vise right there. Gives it a nice and secure mount so that it doesn't slip sideways or turn or anything like that. So I like it in the vise, but either way, you can mount it with uh, posts or you can mount it in the vise. It is up to you. Now, this one right here uh, for standard ultralight Pro V2 regulators. And then they came out with a new one right here for the Pro V3 regulator. So this one is de designed to fit the wider brand new Pro V3. And that one drops in just like that. When it drops in, you can see there's not a lot of wiggle or slop that's inside there. If I take this out and I put one of these in, you can see that it's off center now and it's really wobbly inside there. So don't want to use the Pro V2, the standard, the ultralight regulator in the Pro V3 assembly tool jig. You want to make sure that you're using the appropriate reg in the right one. So there's not slop, there's no wiggle to it. That way when you're using a strap wrench to either tighten or take the bottle off, the bottle's not flopping around on inside there and potentially causing problems. So if you are doing work at home or you are during, uh, during, during doing work for multiple people, maybe you're uh, helping tech for a team or something like that, and you need the ability to uh, remove regulators, or if you're a traveling paintball player and you have to take your bottles apart before you can go onto an airplane uh, or um, travel with them, you need a tool like this to get your regulators off. So this one right here, specifically my Ninja, for Ninja, standard ultralight Pro V2 regulators and Pro V3 regulators. This does work for the stainless steel version as well because the size isn't any different. They're available on the website. Pick yourself up an assembly tool for Ninja regs at ansgear.com.